So I've been on this uh, whirlwind trip. Um, I left at pretty much midnight a couple days ago and um, traveled 600 kilometers all the way down to Shikoku, then all the way around Shikoku. So if you look at Shikoku Island, it's kind of like this. <laughs> I basically went from one end all the way down, around, up, and now I'm going to go back. And um, my goal was to actually um, get some footage of the uh, shrines and interview people. I only got to interview one person. He was the only foreigner I saw that was um, uh, that was doing the the walk. And I got to a couple temples. And then it rained today. So now I'm meeting my mate Marius to talk with. And um, we're going to have Indian food. I'm at this, my favorite Indian restaurant here. And I love Indian food. can never get enough of it. So I'm really excited. Uh, look at this here. Wow. Mm. Actually, that chicken looks really good right there, down there. Four pieces. Tikka, tikka masala. Tikka masala. Anyway, so um, I'm having one beer. Um, I recently learned that Japan isn't zero tolerance. Um, it's actually 0 0.15. 0 0.15. Um, America is like 0 0.8, 0 0.15. So you can get away with drinking one beer and eating and waiting an hour, and by then your, you know, your, your intoxication should be, should be gone, really. So, um, you know, I got some amazing footage and stuff from it, from the show. As you'll see, uh, I swam, I skinny dipped in the river. That was fun. I left my glasses there. That wasn't so much fun. And it would have taken me 20 minutes to go back. I just couldn't be bothered. 20 minutes. You know, I live with, I don't, I rarely use those glasses anyway. So, and the thing is, being Japan, I bet if I returned, you know, three months from now, they'll still be there. Sitting right there where I left them. No one's going to take them. It's a beautiful thing about Japan. Um, Slept in the car, wanted to make omelets for folks, but ultimately um, didn't have the opportunity to do so. I tried, I tried to find one of these, these uh, places where people sleep over, but I couldn't find it. So it's been somewhat of a failure in re regards to the shoot stuff. Um, I did a lot of stuff with bees. I'm pretty shocked at, at so few bees that I found. The bees are really, even in Chicago, are hurting, obviously. And the only thing I can figure with that is it has to be the hornets. So. Ah. That's so good. So now I have another, basically, six hour drive home. I've been driving nonstop. Um, I really enjoyed sleeping in my in our little found ups uh, camper van and um, making omelet and I did learn that um, ultimately I need to uh, change up the supply there's Mary's calling me now yeah hello where are you huh oh, okay you mean come out I'm inside. No, I haven't ordered anything. I just came in. I had a beer since you're like so late. I figured I'd have a beer. I couldn't. Fuck that. No, we're here now. We're eating here. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah. Anyway. So my mate Marius is here. He's arrived.
ねえよ。